what's up guitar players? This is Jen and today we're gonna talk about writing songs in the key of C and what chords you can use to do that. I've been getting a lot of questions about songwriting and how do you know what key you're in or how do you know what chords are going to sound good together. So we're going to take a look at the chords that you can use in the key of C. Now keep in mind with all this music theory I'm going to give you rules but you're going to break them all over the place. So you're going to find examples where the rules are broken and that's okay. But we're going to start with this foundation of the key of C. So the one chord in C is going to be C major. The two chord is D minor. The three chord is E minor. The four is F, or you can use like these little variations on F. Don't feel like you have to do the big bar chord to get around it. The five chord is G, the six is A minor, and the seventh is this B diminished. A lot of times we forget about the B diminished. We don't acknowledge it, but it's a beautiful chord to pull you back into the C. So what I would encourage you to do first is learn all those chord shapes in open position and then just kind of play through so you get a sense for how it moves because all these chords sound really good together because they're all coming out of the same key or the same group of seven notes which in the key of C is C D E F G A B no sharps no flats so for C, we have C, E, G is the chord, that's the triad, D minor, D, F, A, so no sharps, no flats, E minor, E, G, B, F, F, A, C, G, G, B, D, A minor, A, C, E, and then B diminished, B, D, F. So you'll notice if I play a D major, we have an F sharp in there. It's D, F sharp, A, whereas D minor is D, F natural, A. So the reason why we use a D minor instead of a D major in the key of C is because we don't have any sharps or flats, so we need that F natural, not the F sharp. Does that make sense? I hope it does. I know I'm kind of running through this fast, but really what I want you to get out of this are the chords that you can use to play this, any song that you're writing. Um, and know that they're going to sound good together. And then you can do different kinds of styles, like what happens when you finger pick. That's gonna give you a much different sound and a much different feel. So I just did F, G, and C. Then if you did like a reggae thing, And that's how you're going to start to song write, is you take these chords, you put them with your style, and then boom, there's some there's a cre creative magic. Or at least, at least you have a formula or, or a way to start. So I think we're going to try to do a bunch of different keys. Um, so you start to get comfortable with the keys and with the little bit of theory behind the keys. So remember, key of C, no sharps, no flats. Also, little tidbit of information, might be too much, but disregard it if you're not ready for it, is that the key of C and the key of A minor are the same thing. So we can start on A minor on the sixth degree and play the exact same chords and have it still work. So the key of C and the key of A minor are the exact same thing. No sharps, no flats, 
just starting on a different route. So play with that, play with those ideas. Let me know if you have any questions about this particular key or if there's a key that you would really like to write in, let me know. But I think we'll do the kind of the basic ones of G, D, A, F, B flat. So you start to get comfortable with this theory. Let me know if you have any questions about anything. This is a Patreon supported video. So thank you so much to all my patrons who have been with me for several years now that keep these videos going. If you're interested in finding out how to support, then uh, go to www.patreon.com slash gentranny. And there's some rewards and some hangouts and some postcards and some other cool stuff that you can get for supporting. Uh, if not, just uh, like this video, comment, subscribe. You know, you know how YouTube works. Everybody knows how YouTube works. Took me a long time, but because I'm slow. Not today. I'm talking real fast today. But that's it. We're done. We're done with this video. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later.